What's going on guys? Hope you're well and thanks for tuning in to another Sammy Hitsky fishing adventure. Well, you're joining us for part two of the very first day of fishing on the Swains Reef trip with Wilson Tackle. Now, this is the afternoon session you're about to watch and if you saw part one, the fishing was pretty red hot. Well, I can tell you this much, the afternoon session goes even more mental. The GTs bite absolutely off the head. So if you like sports fishing, you're in for an absolute treat. If you don't, there's plenty of reef fishing action as well. So sit back, relax, enjoy this one guys, because I'll tell you what, probably one of the best afternoon fishing out on the reef I've had in a very long time. Cheers. Oh, that was sick. Fun pop. This guy just minced it. You got that vibe on still? There's another G just sitting here under it. Oh. Look at him. Oh, there's another G just there. Look at him. Two so GTs just sitting there. How cool is that? Big bang, right? First pop, destroyed it. How cool. And the ocean thug, the bone, it's killing them. It's going good. Well, there you go. Not as big as the first one, but a good little banger. Get him home. See you, mate. Woo! Away he goes. That was one of the cool hits. First pop. Ball came flying out of the water at it. Again, teamwork. If you don't have someone to reverse the boat out, then you're in the world of herd up there. Unreal. Might give the old sticky a swim. Oh, that was sick. Had two goes on it. Here. Yeah, that should be fine. I don't think it'll get down. This is on the stick bait this time. The 220 Zaplin. Ah, uh, no. <sighs> oh, 
Oh, there's a shark. Oh, that shark is there. Might be a bit better fish. Oh. Yeah, he's a bit better fish. Yeah, it is. Oh. <laughs> How good was that? Oh. <laughs> two and two casts. Yeah, good. That guy took two cracks at it as well, came through, bang, and then sweep, sweep, bang. Uh, that one on the 220 Zaplin and the um, the stick bait Ocean Thug. Oh, this is awesome. That's two and two casts. Yeah, starting to hurt now though. Oh, get this guy back. See you, mate. Yes, this is why you come on those big trips. Have a go, the damage that's been inflicted on this zaplin today. It was brand new out of the pack today and it's been absolutely munched. It's paying for itself. It could be a G. Clint's on, onto something big. This could either be a big, big G or a shark. His head's shaking. Do you need a hand? Do you want me to move that rod? Oh, unfortunately, it'd be the second one. Want to just knife the hooks? He's a lot bigger than he looked. Beautiful. Good result. So we're just at the other side of the uh, point that we've just been casting at. And with a bit of luck, this one's gonna be just as fishy. Uh, oh, 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 oh no! Oh, it's a long time. There was a G on it though. First one was a G. Oh, oh, it's all happening. Oh, I'm gonna get it back in there. Oh, that was epic. Went GT to to long. Oh, oh, oh. No, oh, that was so epic. The zaplin. That fish just hit turbo. Oh. Oh, he's a good one too. Oh, he's only just hooked. Woo! 
That's three. <laughs> oh, that's three, and I missed one the cast before. Oh my goodness. Well, guys, that is number three in about five casts. Missed one the cast before. This guy absolutely destroyed it. One of the cooler hits of the day. Tell you what, I'm tired, but you just can't stop when this fishing is this good. Ah! All right, another releasey. See you, mate. Woo! Another battle scar for the Zeppelin. <laughs> Look at it now. It's not going to have any paint by the end of it. Oh, I was just saying before, I might even. Oh, no, actually, I'm not going to say it. I want to jinx it. I don't want to jinx it. I'm just going to keep catching fish on it. If I happen to retire it at the end of the day, it happens to get retired. I might even refresh my knot here, but that is too good. Clint's just hooked a bottom fish and it's been eaten by something and it's not doing sharky things. This may well be something like a mackerel or possibly a doggy. I'm not going to call any. It could even be a G. He's just had a bottom fish and got slammed. He's gained a fair bit of line on it, which says it's not a shark because they usually do sharky things. And this isn't what they do. Still, still thumping? Yeah, had a decent reef fish on too, like, you know, I knew it was not bad. Yeah. Copy that, Well, this isn't fighting like a shark. Yeah, thanks, 10 to 6. Uh, see you up there. Radio, 10 to 6 out. Shark, no, that's a fucking, it's a mackerel. It's a mackerel or a big doggy. It's a big... Grab the gaff. Where, yeah. where, oh, yeah. Mackerel or dog? Oh, it's a big spano. Here we go. Oh my goodness. It's a huge spano. Have a go at the size of this. Are we gaffing it or tailing it? Yeah, gaff it. Right. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> Have a go at the size of this, Mackie. No wire. Oh, we got to get this guy on the front deck. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> Good fish. He'd be 25. He'd be 25 and the rest. That No, that's 30. Oh, Look we'll, at it. I'll take it back and weigh it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, that's what happens when you hook a bottom fish. You sure you hooked a bottom fish? Yeah, yeah, because it was coming up. Look, he's had some. Sun's had a go. We can, if you don't want to keep him, we can probably release him because I only got him in the in the jaw there. If you want to hold him up for a shot, and we'll dump him back. Oh, I'm easy. <laughs> oh, we're not going to eat him. That's that's a Sig Monster 2000. Yeah, we'll get it. Yeah. Get it. Get it. Jump up there, and I'll um I'll get the camera ready. Right, ho, that is a monster mackerel. I've got the size, but on gang hooks. Now we only I gaffed him in the corner of the mouth there, so we're going to let him go. Send him back, mate. Oh, don't point him at me. <laughs> Three, two, one. Woo! <laughs> Mate, well done. What a fish. Oh, yep. Yep. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have to go back. <laughs> Oh, that is GT number four for the Arvo. Oh, I hooked that fish right up there in the shallows, right on the reef edge, and just locked up and dragged him out. No dramas. 
Oh, that's a good fish. He'd be, he'd be best part of 15. He's a good fish. I just changed from the stick bait. I was, uh, I was having a lovely time on the stick bait, but a long time coming scratched up my leader, and I didn't have time to retie it, so put the chugger on for a quick go, and uh, well, chugger on the chugger, say no more. Well, number four. Ah. See ya, mate. Oh. Quick change over. Chucking the uh, fish trap. There's heaps of fish on the bottom there. And with a bit of luck, get a nice big red throat emperor or trout. Big fish, big fish. <laughs> oh no. Thank you. That's a big jobby. He's got a jobby. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> you buddy ripper. Woo! Have a go at that. Absolutely munched that fish trap. Big green job fish. I'll tell you what, that's a handful on this gear, but got him. Oh. And the fish trap on the drop. Bang. I'm trying to film a closer and Clint's into another one. <laughs> Call it. Oh, it might be a trout, I think. Trouty. It was a poor call. Oh, it's a long nose emperor. There you go. Long nose emperor. Well, what a first day that was. Mate, did we, or did we not catch some fish? <laughs> yeah, I certainly did, mate. It was unreal. Yeah. Mass massive thank you to Clint, because he gave up a lot of fishing time to uh, to chase GTs with me on the edges there, and he did a lot of reversing, a lot of boat maneuvering, so a big thank you for that. No worries, mate, all good. But tomorrow is another day, and you'll have to wait until next week to see that video. So if you like to learn something, make sure you crush that like button, subscribe, comment, all that fun stuff. There is plenty more fishing action to come over the next few days and you guys are going to see it. But from the super green boat, that's goodbye for today. Hope you enjoyed it.